So here we have a 2001 BMW M3 Coupe. We're doing OEM business CD radio to OEM navigation retrofit. Here are some of the parts needed for the rear left driver's side trunk area. We have the trunk liner, GPS computer, navigation tuner, BM53, brackets, and uh, OEM amp amplifier. Okay, first things first. Disconnect the battery. Retrofit harness does come with instructions. It may be a little confusing. This is how it will be set up. That's just a climate relocation bracket for the Navi. You will need this. Here's the main retrofit harness needed for the swap have the wires running into the fuse box and the driver's side into the speedometer okay so we have the driver's side ground wire from the retrofit kit connecting to the back of the cluster right over here So we plug this into pin number eight. Now here we have the blue wire it goes all the way into the fuse box. We take it from the back of this section look for the yellow and blue wires and then you just basically replace it into one of these simple as that plug and play and then you put it back into here if you want to take the whole thing out you go from this side you disconnect it from here doesn't matter which area as long as it goes into the blue and yellow and that's it So we have the navigation screen and the connectors right over here. We're gonna plug them into the side of the navigation screen. Blue first, then white. So here's the plug for the stock business radio. You're gonna connect it into the retrofit connector. like that this is for the auxiliary we're gonna talk about that later and we just run it underneath the carpets on the side to the back take this thing out there part of the harness you have the ground wire this is a good spot.
And up here, this is for the 2001s only. Where you have to take this piece out for the aerial antenna. Once again, this is for the 2001s only. So we have the brackets installed, connected with the amp. So now we're gonna connect the BM53 Navi tuner. Don't forget the antenna. After now connect the GM. Now we have the navigation system. We have the red and blue connectors. Do the blue first. Subwoofer connected, all speakers connected. And here's one thing that you have to make sure you plug in the cluster first or else the GPS won't work or turn on. Now you don't need a CD changer. If you want one, you can always just add it to the back. And here I'm gonna explain the auxiliary. If you want auxiliary, you just take this wire and you get the wire harness from the dealer. I think it's like $40. This plugs into the aux cable, and this goes into the harness of the retrofit. In this case, we have both females, so the retrofit harness does come with a kit where you can separate this and make it into a male and plugs into the harness, and that will work. 